Good morning from Saxony, Germany. It is just about 5 a.m. and the sun is about to rise just over there. And check this place out. This is the Saxony, Switzerland National Park and it is pretty stunning. Really, really good place for shooting. I am here on a Travel Dudes campaign in partnership with Saxony Tourism and they brought us along for seven days to make uh, four videos. Again, two behind the scenes sort of vlog videos about the destination and about uh, the information on how you can travel here and where you can go, what you can do, including this place. And then two cinematic videos like uh, we did in Finland as well. So um, one about the activities and then one about sort of the culture and the lifestyle. Uh, so far it's been an amazing trip. Still got three days to go but I'm only going to vlog today for my own channel because uh, we're exploring this national park today and then going to a UNESCO World Heritage Site this afternoon and I think that it'll make for really good vlog content. So I want to share a little bit more of the behind the scenes while on campaign for travel videography and photography um, and yeah again this is with Travel Dudes and Saxony Tourism who are the uh, partners for the campaign and I am up at well, I was up at 4.30 this morning to get to this amazing spot to set up uh, some time lapse as well as get some still images. And yeah, I think so far it's been pretty good. So let's show you a little bit of sexy Switzerland at sunrise. After what was an incredible sunrise shoot, I got some really, really nice images. Fast forward till about 9.30 and we're in a town called Bad Schandau. Um, and I guess one of the parts of the behind the scenes that I want to share with you guys is how the days are scheduled when you're on a videography and photography campaign. So usually there's an itinerary and every day is kind of full. So there really isn't a lot of time for editing uh, or a lot of downtime. It's usually kind of go, 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 go. So what I try and do is get the itinerary in advance and then sort of memorize it like two days, maybe even one day before so that when I go into making the vlogs, I know uh, every scene that is happening before uh, we actually start doing it. And that makes it a lot easier to, uh, to record this stuff. Where are we going today? We are going to the most stunning views we got in Saxon, Switzerland. So we are going to Schramstein Aussicht, which sounds pretty hard, but it's really like perfect. <laughs> Right now I'm hiking through this really beautiful forest sort of woodland and uh, with the GH5 you're able to do variable frame rates to get like a really nice uh, slow motion effect. But if you guys are shooting with uh, the GH5 or any other camera, try and get like maybe 60 frames per second or a variable frame rate of 90 or something to really slow it down by 33% or 50% and get the sun in the frame with a wide angle. You get some really nice effect that way. And uh, I think personally it looks great. So I'll share a little bit of that right now, but that's one of my tips for hiking shots. Get some slow motion of the experience. And you can also do that with people's feet um, or yeah, close-ups of like the hands or people looking up, whatever. But some nice tips for when you're in a forest. back on the vlog uh, this is the top of our hike um, it's not too strenuous but it took about two hours and I brought up the tripod I've got a carbon fiber tripod that I travel with and it fits in my day pack which is pretty nice and it doesn't weigh very much so this tends to be what I use for any kind of long exposure or time lapses and I've got a polarizer filter on the 16 to 35 looking out to that scene yeah, just letting it run for about 10 minutes and I think I'll get a pretty nice time lapse out of that. But uh, yeah, this is just a bit of the gear that I'm carrying up with me every day when I'm working.
And we are back down from the sandstone peaks of Saxon Switzerland National Park. It is an absolutely beautiful day today. It's 30 degrees on the banks of the Elbe River. And this afternoon we are heading about two hours northeast to the border with Poland, where there is a UNESCO World Heritage Site, and we are going to be doing a bike tour through it. So, here we go. Crossing the border on a bike. <laughs> ah, cool. Going to Poland right now on this bridge. I think I'm probably there. Over halfway. We're in Poland. Ah, come stay with me. It is surprisingly difficult to film with a three axis gimbal and a GH5 in one hand while cycling. And I've got this uh, perfect little basket, if you can see it on the back here, with my day pack in it. And I've got the drone in there and the tripod and just trying to kind of keep that all together while cycling. And the trick that I found is sort of stopping when you see the scene that you want to shoot and then setting up the camera, setting up your frame rate and then going for it, you know, and finishing stopping the bike and then turning off the camera. Because uh, if you don't do it that way, it's just too, I guess, risky to, uh, to try and be operating the camera in manual while cycling at the same time on bumpy roads. Evening has fallen upon us here in Saxony, Germany. I have said goodbye to the bike tour. Uh, actually took the bike back to the hotel to switch up the gear, put the drone away, picked up the Canon 5D3 and a couple lenses and the filters, and then bike back out here to see if I could get some compositions and some images this evening. Got one or two that I think are okay, um, and I'll throw them into the video here. But I also wanted to uh, to wrap up the video and uh, and call it an end to this vlog. I uh, hope you've enjoyed this one. Thanks as always for watching a bit more behind the scenes on my work here in Europe as a travel videographer and photographer. Hope some of these tips have helped you guys. I know some of you watching are doing this job or, uh, or you want to be doing this job. So these are just some of the things that we deal with uh, every day when we're on assignment. Um, and yeah, that's about that. It's uh, one more day here in Saxony for me and then off to Spain to Santiago de Compostela uh, for a uh, hiking campaign on El Camino. And I will again try and vlog behind the scenes on that one too. So I hope you like this video. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you on the next one.